Hi, this is Preeti. Welcome back to Analytics India magazine. When it comes to data science as a career, many people these days are switching their careers to enter into this domain or upskilling themselves in order to become a data scientist. So information regarding mistakes that other data scientists have made before you becomes very crucial. So let's go take a look at some of the common mistakes and hopefully you can avoid committing them. Coming to the first mistake, wasting time concentrating only on theory. Many data scientists spend too much time learning theoretical concepts related to maths and machine learning like linear algebra, stats, algorithms, deviation, etc. It is good to have thorough knowledge of these concepts, but from the very beginning, if they do not apply and practice them, it would create a gap between practical and theoretical knowledge. So it becomes imperative to apply these fundamental concepts as one goes on learning them. Here are the list of some data sets that you can practice to make your basic concepts clear. Human activity, wine quality, movie recommendation and Titanic. You will find the links to these data sets in the description box below. Coming to the second mistake, being hasty. Many beginners make the mistake of jumping in too deep at an early stage. No matter how passionate one is about learning and applying data science, they have to go through fundamental concepts one by one. Avoiding shortcuts is better in this case. A beginner can first try to master techniques and algorithms of classical machine learning which will serve as a stepping stones for further advanced concepts. However, one needs to make sure that they have ample amount of practice before they move on to advanced concepts. In episode 3 of how to start a career in data science, we have actually spoken about machine learning concepts and how to go about with them with relevant projects. Don't forget to check that out. Coming to the third mistake, coding without understanding the prerequisites. This is another common mistake committed by beginners where they code an algorithm with the intention of making it perfect rather than learning it. Coding an algorithm from scratch without complete knowledge will eventually lead to problems. To refine one's understanding, there are a few concepts that a data science beginner needs to have. These concepts include linear algebra, statistics, probability and calculus. Data science includes all these concepts, so it is recommended not to move forward until you have a strong hold on these basic concepts. Coming to the next mistake, relying solely on certificates and degrees. Ever since data science became popular, certificates and degrees have cropped up just about everywhere. There are too many of these courses online and are completed by thousands of aspiring data scientists. Hiring managers look beyond certificates and test you for how you've applied this knowledge in real-life practical situations. Hence, it becomes very important to create a portfolio apart from your formal certificates, preferably on popular sites like GitHub. You would also need to actively take part in discussions and competitions like hackathons to improve your skills. Coming to the next point, not studying in a consistent manner. This one applies to all data scientists, not just freshers. We have a tendency to get distracted easily. We study for a period of time, say a month, and then we give it a break for the next two months. Most of the earlier concepts are forgotten and you have to start all over again. But to be a successful data scientist, it demands consistent effort and learning. So the only solution is set goals for yourself, make a timetable and make sure that you stick to it. For example, if you want to learn about neural network, make sure that you make a timetable and a schedule for the theoretical concepts and stick to it and then participate in competitions like hackathon to test your theory. Moving on to the next mistake, trying to learn too many tools at once. There are too many tools nowadays that offer a variety of unique features and applications. So when a beginner leans towards learning all the tools possible at once and also try to apply them at the same time, it will only lead to more confusion and will affect one skill when it comes to problem solving. Learn a particular tool and master it and when one is sure that they have perfected it, then they can approach a different tool according to its use. And while learning these tools are essential, it is also important to know how these tools can help solve real-world business problems. Coming to the last mistake, not emphasizing on storytelling or basically communication skills. Whatever insights a data scientist draws from the company's data has to be effectively communicated to the non-technical teams. These technical insights have to be clear, accurate and must be easily understood by the organization. One has to give importance to this aspect because communication, brainstorming and discussion are very important when it comes to data science. 
One trick for someone to improve their communication skills could be to learn how to visually represent their insights. Skillfully putting one's thoughts into a slideshow or any other approved form can be one way to effectively communicate. With that, we come to the end of this video. Don't forget to subscribe to Analytics India magazine and follow this segment for everything related to data science as a career. See you soon. Bye.